National Guard Sergeant Melts Hearts Reuniting with Beloved Dog After Month Apart The worst thing that could happen to a fur mom happened to Indiana National Guard Sergeant Julian Sandifer one June day. She and her beloved dog Murphy were separated after an accident caused him to run off. Sergeant Julian Sandifer was driving down Route 35 in West Virginia when she lost control of her car and it rolled over. Murphy was spooked and ran off towards the northbound side of Route 35. Unfortunately, Murphy's dog tags came off him, so it was going to be extra challenging to find him. Plus, Sergeant Sandifer had to go back to Indiana the next day for work at the Indiana National Guard, and she had to rely on the kindness of the locals to help her find Murphy. She still held hope that they'd be reunited before she gets deployed with her unit in September. I'm so sorry, Murphy. I hope that you're safe. I hope that we'll still be able to find you. Mommy loves you, Sergeant Sandifer wrote on her Facebook post. Local residents Misty Burdett and Becky Randolph helped the National Guard sergeant find her fur baby by coming back to the crash site regularly. They checked paw prints at the site if they matched Murphy's, and they always smoothened the paw prints they found to make it easier for them to identify the paw prints they hadn't checked yet. Doing this will help them determine the freshness of the paw print. Mason County Animal Shelter also helped with the search by lending them an extra-large trap to fit Murphy. They filled the trap with Sergeant Sandifer's and Murphy's things that Misty took from the wrecked car. Sergeant Sandifer also mailed some of her clothes to them that they could use for the search. But Murphy's a smart dog. He was able to make his way back to the crash site, but he wouldn't go into the trap. Instead, he snuck through a waterway structure that the rescuers couldn't reach. Both the rescuers and Murphy wouldn't give up. The rescuers installed a trail camera, so they're alerted when Murphy finally went into the trap. And finally, one month and two days later, Murphy went into the trap. Another rescuer, Jason Jeffers, picked him up, and they informed Sergeant Sandifer of the good news. Becky and her partner, Tara, agreed to hold on to Murphy until he was reunited with Sergeant Sandifer. While it turned out Tara's aunt lived 30 minutes away from Sergeant Sandifer's location, and it will be a double reunion. So the next day, Tara and their son, Braden, and a few other rescuers boarded Murphy into their car and made the overnight trip to Indiana. They arrived on Saturday morning and reunited Murphy with his mom. Sergeant Sandifer was so ecstatic to be reunited with her fur baby. She wanted to give Becky and Tara a reward, but they refused and said that this was an act of kindness that needed no reward. Sergeant Sandifer wrote them a heartfelt note instead to express her gratitude to the couple and the rescuers. To my heroes, Sergeant Sandifer wrote, it's not every day that you encounter people who are exceptionally selfless to others, such as yourself. My fur baby family and I couldn't be more grateful. Please accept this card and photos as a token of our appreciation for everything you've done to bring Murphy home. Please share this with your friends and family. <laughs>